cut my fingers. I mean, you couldn't have tenderized you or something marinated it. Give me that box. Give me that, that Band-Aid box. You don't need those. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to say? I can cook if I want to. Yeah, if you want to pull a couple of teeth out, you know, Whoa. while you're biting the meat. Okay, okay, whatever. <laughs> Didn't we say we were going to have a guest to come on the show and make some fabulous something for us? Yeah, I think we said it was going to be Yolanda. Yolanda, Yolanda that's barbecue. right, that's right. Okay. You want me to call her? To the diva phone. Okay. Yolanda, Yolanda. Oh, oh, I got you. Hi, Yolanda. Listen, we need help. We need help quick in a hurry. Yeah, this time, uh, Yvonne, she's wearing bandages on all of her fingers. I was going to ask why. I, I know nothing about it. Yeah, oh, but you you did. You made all kinds of wonderful food for all. Oh, thank you so much. That's going to be fantastic. All right, when can you make it? Oh, no. It's going to take you that long? Oh, my God. Listen, okay, okay. Well, we'll wait it out. We'll sweat it out. Okay, thank you, Yvonne. We love you, Yolanda. We love you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> She's going to be here. It's going to be wild. Oh, oh, thank God. What's that? That's the, door the doorbell. Bell? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Is that the doorbell? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Do you see anybody? Do you see anybody? Yeah. Somebody's her? smiling. It's, it's oh! Yolanda. All right. Oh, Yolanda. All right. Come on, girl. Come to the rescue. Come on. Come on, Yolanda. I'm here. Let's okay. do thing today. Look at you. Here. Thanks for coming and saving us. You're going to cook some grill for us today. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I have some delicious uh, recipes for us to eat today. Oh, Ooh, that is fabulous. Good. Yeah, I have smoked mm -hmm. barbecue potato salad. Okay. Mm. Barbecue chicken. Oh. And barbecue ribs. Oh and I'm, I'm making Yolanda's famous barbecue baked beans. Oh, my oh gosh. Listen, God, you guys, Yolanda. don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. <laughs> okay. A diva going to hook some divas up over here. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Yeah. It's Yolanda. called the Barbecue Church. <laughs> and we're featuring the world-renowned, famous Miss Yolanda Williams, who is the owner of the Barbecue House Ministries. And I'm like, yes. oh, my God. I'm so okay. happy you're here. And with your Patty LaBelle looking self, look at you. <laughs> yes, she she does, hi. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you? What are you going to prepare for us? I'm going to make barbecue grilled potato salad, mm -hmm. and I'm also going to make Yolanda's famous barbecue baked beans. Okay. And I'm going to talk about how to season your chicken and get it ready to make barbecue chicken on the grill, which I named it Home Barbecue Chicken, the name of my mm -hmm. father's restaurant. All right, wow. let's do it. Let's do okay. it. Where do so, we first of all, we're going to make this wonderful gourmet smoked potato salad. I've already boiled five pounds of potatoes, and they're the red potatoes. So, these are the cooked potatoes going in. Mm -hmm. And <clears throat> I'm going to um, cut up some mushrooms, boiled egg, some thyme, and onion. And I'm going to put those ingredients inside of the potato salad. And after that, I'm going to make the dressing. The dressing is going to have half of the boiled egg will be cut in half, and then it's going to be the egg yolk mixed with mayonnaise. And I will take a little bit of that and put it in here. Now, the dressing is for what? Um, the dressing for the potato salad? Yes, the dressing okay. for the potato salad is boiled eggs and mayonnaise and oh. our secret seasoning. Oh. And so I put a little bit of that in here. Yeah. Look out. It's a secret we can't know. Yeah, we no, can't know that, about that. And, and, <laughs> and I'm also going to put a little garlic. I've cut that up and I put it in here. And, and then you just stir it and you have this easy, wonderful gourmet potato salad. You can mm. take your barbecue dinner up a notch just making this wonderful salad. Oh, and nice. all of my friends just love it when they come. Oh, so um, that's how you make the potato salad. All so right. that's done. And I'm going to make my wonderful barbecue baked beans. Mm. And first thing I do, I cut up some green onions, and I cut up some bell pepper, and I put those in the skillet, uh -huh. and I sweat them just a little bit to take that little crunch edge off. And then I add my <coughs> turkey meat. This is ground turkey, which is very healthy for you. Uh -huh. And I put that inside, and I cook that and fry that up. Okay. with the onions and the bell pepper. Uh -huh. And then I'll take a cup of this barbecue sauce okay, and I'll pour it inside of this um, skillet and okay. add that to it. 
and then I stir it up. And then I, after I get it all stirred up and cooked together, I run it in the oven with a little brown sugar, a little mustard, and a little seasoning. Mm -hmm. And you cook it for like 20 minutes. And after you do that, you have the wonderful Yolanda's Bake mm, Barbecue wow. Beans. And only 20 minutes? It's 20 Ooh. minutes in the oven. It's real quick. That's and pretty good. You know, everybody thinks barbecue foods, the size, take a long time, but it's short. It can okay. be short and fast. Beautiful. And also, I wanted to talk about how to season up your barbecue chicken. You need to make a rub of dry ingredients. I can't tell you what my secret ingredients are, ladies. Oh, come on, Yolanda. <laughs> just one. Well, I, I'll just say one is seasoning salt. Okay. okay, and I have some other special things that I add to it. Okay. And so you, you stir all those dry ingredients together, and you wash your ticket, chicken, and you pat it dry, and then you put the seasoning on it, and you wrap it in clear cellophane wrap. Wow. And put it in the refrigerator overnight, oh. and that's the secret. Oh. The next morning when you put that barbecue on the grill, you have the best barbecue chicken you've ever eaten. Mm. It is seasoned to the bone. Ooh, that sounds that good. Just, just the best yeah, barbecue chicken you've ever That's what you call marinating, right? Yes. Hi, it's Yvonne. Marinating yeah, about marinating. Dry rub. I wrap my feet up at night with Vaseline and cellophane <laughs> to keep them soft oh. the next day. But I never tried it on chicken. <laughs> <laughs> to try it. That's diva maintenance. I love it. Diva maintenance. I love it. Yeah. Great. So this is... Um, and so you have the potato salad, the beans, mm -hmm. and the chicken. Yes. So we are going to take a little break. Yes. And we're going to come back, and we're gonna, you're going to bedazzle us, diva dazzle us, with yes. this wonderful plate of food that you have, this wonderful recipe. Can't we can't wait. wait for you to try it. Oh, it's going to be fabulous, I, I know. Myself. Okay, so guys, without further ado, we'll be back in a few, and we're going to get down to the get down, okay? <laughs> right. Yes. Yeah. 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 My mama's watering. Give her five. Mm. Give her five over there for hooking us up. Oh, Give her. Yolanda. It's called the Barbecue Church. Yes, five, girl. yes, yes. Thank you okay, for coming. Okay, all right. <laughs> See you guys in a minute. Back in a minute. Hey guys, we made it back, and we have our beautiful diva here, honorary diva of the day, Yolanda, and she has whipped it up, like really, really, really whipped it up, like never before. This is like. Yolanda, you're just a blessing. Mm. Um, this food looks incredible. Where's your plate? Tom, where's mine? Oh, thank you. Aww. Thank you, Tom. Now, Tom, who is Tom to you? Oh, Tom is a friend I, I met at Starbucks, and him and I are in cooking ministries together, and that's what we do. So. Oh, that is yeah, such a blessing. He is to here helping you today. Yes, and he everything is. is such a wonderful. fine friend. In fact, I think we're going to need some knives. This chicken looks so yum. Mm. Tom, can you bring us a knife? Thank you. Thank can you I so with much. my hands? Is that okay? She's oh, a girl. I'm on TV. I can't do it. <laughs> I don't want to get too ghetto. <laughs> Thank Yvonne. you. Mind your manners now. I will. I will. Thank you. No, more, no licking my fingers. and. This the barbecue, so you can kind of lick your fingers mm. on it. Listen, mm. before we plow in here, and I got to hold this one up because she will th slap that gum on that plate, the New York minute, and it is on and crack it. Tell us, Yolanda, about your church barbecue. Church barbecue? Yeah. Of all things, I love that title. Don't you love that? Are they barbecuing in church? Ch the what is the story behind church barbecue? The story is it originated from my father um, being a pastor. And he wanted to uh, build a bigger church. And so he had a restaurant in the city of Compton Ooh. since 1961. Wow. So he thought he'd bring his recipe down to the church and sell dinners um, as a fundraiser to, to raise money to buy and um, build the church. Heavy. And so oh. that's how it began. And it be got so large till he started helping um, students to get their college education that would work down at the church. And oh, we nice. served many celebrities and mm. many politicians. He had um, Mr. Kenneth Hahn, who's um, not with us anymore. He yeah. was always supporting my father. Wow. Mm. And so our whole family worked. My mom, Mrs. Toledo Williams, who's uh, passed away in 2006 oh, and, and my uh, brother and I have two brothers and two sis one sister okay. and all of us worked at the barbecue church oh, and wow. so it, it's only on Friday and Saturday in oh, the city okay. of Los Angeles at oh. the prayer assembly Church of God in Christ Oh, all right. right. The Barbecue Church. I just heavy. love that title. Mm -hmm. That is so, mm -hmm. it sets you apart. It makes you so distinct. And it just is like a fun title. 
It's yeah. the barbecue church. Who knew? <laughs> <laughs> we love it. Have a Bible so, in one hand and an apron in the other. Exactly. <laughs> and a big old tug of neck. No, <laughs> tug of neck. Listen, um, can we get started? Can we try your? Oh, absolutely. absolutely. It's Please so pretty. Do. We hate to even try mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. mess it up. It's just gorgeous. I hope the, the camera's getting a good shot of this. <laughs> Yeah. I see we have mm. um, oh, plastic spoons and forks. And oh, yeah, we'll get into that. Thing. We'll tell you what that's all about after we get through this. It's going to be kind of hard to eat this barbecue oh, like that. Oh, this good. is so good. Now, you have barbecue oh, sauce as well, right? Yes, we have a secret mm. sauce. Okay. And it's right here. Oh, oh God, let, 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 um, okay. Oh, oh. Tom is Thank there you, to Tom, help for helping us. This is not like a nightmare, like her cooking. Yeah, the spoon. This is a Oh, man. Hope the fireworks are going off on you. <laughs> Can I try a little bit of that sauce? Oh yes, he's gonna give me a spoon. Oh, oh you get it? Okay. This is so good. Even and I love it. that little kettle. That's like a. Mm. Thank you, Tom. So tender. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, Compton and South Central have some great cooks. Yeah, so I'm we actually hometown. built a church selling barbecue every Friday and Saturday. Mm. Wow, and it's that's amazing. it's just been a. Um, so you actually can build a wow. church from from selling. I mean, you hear about. Uh, bake sales and things like that, but this is serious money. We you guys sold are barbecue, wow. and it was open every oh, Friday and Saturday, and people came from far and near. Really, and one, it was kind of like we moved the ministry from the church mm. to the parking lot. So my wow. father would pray for people out there and witness, and oh. we'd sell them barbecue, and they help us over here, raise okay. money to build our church. Beautiful. So yeah. What, a, been a what wonderful an intriguing experience. story. Mm. What an intriguing story. So your father was the head administrator of all this. It was his Absolutely. idea. It started with him. Mm -hmm. Where was his church located, uh, Yolanda? It was on 442 East Compton Boulevard. Oh, okay. I think oh, I passed up there gosh. before. Oh, friends I, I did speak of the address of the uh, restaurant. Mm -hmm. Yolanda. Oh, God. I know they have yeah. the best yeah. cooks in Compton. And won't be able to do that. Yeah. But the, uh, the mm -hmm. church was on 442 East mm -hmm. El Segundo Boulevard in the corner of Avalon and El Segundo. Oh, yeah. Now, where did you get the idea of putting mushrooms in the potato salad? Oh, it's kind of like, it added like a meaty taste, and it's so, oh. it's, it, it's so delicious. Mm -hmm. I love the texture. I like textures. Mm -hmm. And actually, I didn't tell you all one of the secret things of this salad that we sweated uh, the vegetables and we smoked the potatoes on the grill. Oh, oh my so God. that's what makes a smoked potato salad. You guys are all three out. times more than the average restaurant going through all these different steps. Yes. Oh, the this is and the beans. Oh my goodness. Chain. Now you said inside the beans there is actually ground turkey meat. Ground turkey. Mm -hmm. Now where did you come up with this concept from? Was this your dad or concept of uh, your this own? This is my recipe. Ah. And I just, uh, I thought it was healthy meat to put inside of the beans. And sometimes I have ribs and everything. Some people don't like ribs. They like only chicken. So I said, well, let me give them another meat. I'll put it in the beans. Aha. Uh -huh. And it's girl. smoked um, They turkey. are delicious. Off the chain. Oh, girlfriend. Mm, thank you. Mm, just mm. out of sight. This is truly a blessing. Mm -hmm. So, you know, your, so your goals, what are you, what are, what's happening in your life at this point? Well, right now we're in the process of relocating the barbecue church. Okay. My father is 89 years old, Aww. and he's just retired. That's a blessing. Aww. And so we're in the process of finding a new location to sell the barbecue so we can continue his legacy. Because there's a great mm -hmm. legacy of barbecue yeah, well, that built a church. Now, if people want to get in contact with you, how would they do that? Um, you can um, catch me on my email. Mm -hmm. It's Yolanda.7. Renee. Nixon at gmail.com. Now, do you special order? Do you cater? Do you how does well, that right now? Uh, we're in the process of catering. Uh -huh. So, if you'd like to order something, you can um, check my uh, get in touch with me on my email. Yeah, and I'm telling you guys, this is really good. Me. We're ordering everybody to go to her restaurant oh, and by all try means. this food, man. This is off the chain. This is the best stuff I had all year. Oh, <laughs> mm -hmm, oh, I know. Oh. Some chicken is you, undercooked ladies. and some of it's overcooked. This is perfect. Mm -hmm. You need a knife to cut it. Mm -hmm. We ain't hardly talking the show because we <laughs> just have to cut all this stuff down out there. Mm -hmm. If she wasn't a woman, I'd marry her. Oh, <laughs> oh that is so cute. Well, my dad, well, his delicious. famous saying was, thank God for the victory today. Mm -hmm. And so I feel that this is a victory to be able to share my dad and mom's legacy oh, and how they built the Prayer Assembly Church of God in Christ selling barbecue. 
and many Ooh. lives were changed and souls were fed. When people actually ate and they were happy. And we sold um, mm -hmm. to all people from every walk of life. But one special thing my father continued to do was mm -hmm. to feed the homeless. So oh. every, everybody that needed something to eat that didn't have money, they were able to line up with the customers and okay. they were served free food. Wow. And I think that's why the ministry went on for as long as it did. That is amazing. You guys, I just love all your work. I mean, you just have so many blessings in store as far as I'm concerned with being able to do this for people. And yes. It's, like, it's, it's truly a legacy. And, and when you see people of color, it's good to see that they have that family tradition. Mm -hmm. And they're blessed to have a daughter such as yourself you. that is carrying on the legacy. You are truly a true diva. <laughs> yes. you, you guys, we really did it. We got a real diva on the show. I mean, well, look I at her. And you look fabulous. Oh. I learned from the best. My mother, Mother Toledo Williams, she was the diva of all times. Oh. And my father, Elder Clavester Williams, he was married to the diva. All right. There you <laughs> so hey. I am just a pro. <laughs> Two snaps. Of the diva. Okay, two <laughs> snaps up and a, okay, all right, I love it. Listen, we want to crown you, we, all, we, we do this with our honorary diva of the day, yes. and you, my dear, have passed that test. I'm beyond colors. Oh. Uh, if, if I can stop eating long enough, uh -oh. we'll pass the crown. <laughs> we'll, Enjoy yourself. We'll, pa <laughs> we'll pass the crown over and get you crowned over here in a minute. Let's see, take that bubble gum out your mouth. She knows how to eat and chew bubble gum at the same time. <laughs> this is our crown, crowning you an honorary oh, diva of the you, day. Oh, this is for you, Lady Yolanda. Oh, wow. Yes, we want to thank you the so diva. much. And now we want to divatize you. you. For being a guest on the show, please my dear, to come back on the show at any time. How special. Thank you so Thank very you. much. So honored. We're With just food. happy. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Absolutely. And Lord bless this food oh, and keep it coming. Gosh, this is a beautiful lady. Oh my God. Yay. Love it. Where's my little racket at? Thank you. Just so eat. Give me that thing. She eats, she eats, I was going to take a bite of that too. <laughs> With the sauce on it. It's it's so good. This is not a turkey leg, you lady. <laughs> oh, lady Yvonne. With her sauce, it would be. <laughs> yes. So, you know, once again, we want you to tell the people how they can get in contact with you. Okay, you can um, get in touch with me through my email, yolanda.7.renee at gmail.com. All right. Yay. Oh, Thank oh, you for being yeah. a guest on the show. You're so wonderful. All right, you guys. Well, that concludes another episode of Real Divas Cook. And thanks for watching. We're always going to have some wonderful, good stuff to eat. But I don't know if too many people can top this lady. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye. Let's Bye -bye. blow them a kiss. And you know us divas never do silverware, so we use our plastic forks. And, Ooh, hey, we don't bust no suds. Oh, up in the air they go. <laughs> <laughs> And we do a little diva dance at the end of the show. In your case, we're going to dance with Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You are happy.